There are now privacy concerns tonight as Seattle City Light is asking its customers to install new electric meters that can monitor use on a minute to minute basis. That's already happened at the local utility that serves North Bend. Cairo 7's Essex Porter talked with a couple who's suing to keep smart meters away from their home. In North Bend and the surrounding area, power comes from the Tanner Electric Co op. And instead of meter readers, the company uses digital smart meters, which send the co op information about a home's electrical usage. But not at the Costello home, where the owners insist on keeping their old meter and put up a metal bar so it can't be removed. Larry Costello is an electrical engineer. The issue that we have uh, with the smart meter technology is that it really is an invasion of privacy to the homeowner. Inside the house, the Costellos are worried that the smart meter can tell the company when appliances are on, and if sensitive enough, can even tell which television channel they're watching. The Costellos are suing Tanner to get more information about the meters, and because the co-op now charges $23 a month to send someone to read his old-style meter. The general manager at Tanner can't say much because of the lawsuit, but he told me their smart meters do not have the ability to monitor your appliances or tell which television channel you're watching. I don't know what the future holds. I don't want to be told when I can run my dishwasher and when I can run my refrigerator. So those are my concerns, and also knowing when I'm home and when I'm not home. Tanner says they have upwards of 5,000 customers and that only two have opted out of the smart meter program. In North Bend, Essex Porter, Cairo 7, Eyewitness News. Seattle City Light is taking public comment until 7.30 tonight at Northgate Community Center. It plans to begin installing smart meters in 2015. Seattle